you know. That's the, what they're there for. The voters for. spoke, and they put Geraldine in office. And That's not it. only was she elected, but she was elected in first place. Yes. Yes. Yeah, so that says a lot. And she, not just her hard work, but it says that she was able to cross over to voters and get her message out there. Well, those people, people believe in her. Yeah. And Doug Peters, Senator Peters, is your, yes. you've, you've got to have a good rapport, and it's good to hear you have. And I think all of them support the city of Bowie very well. Absolutely. Uh, in their roles, and uh, probably a lot of people over the years have told me, look, Bowie look, thinks they should have everything when they go to the state. And these other people are always fighting some of our board delegates in the county. And that, over the years, those things have been that way. And it's uh, mm -hmm. why I know when I traveled uh, around the county more, uh, people would say, oh, boy, you, that's the city gets everything. This is back 20 years ago. Well, it's the largest well, municipality. Well, you know, but it, it's changed a lot in that respect. And that, that, that's, that's really unfortunate people would say that. But you, you have to look at this and be real about it. We are voters. We're taxpayers, yeah. and we are the biggest, the biggest taxpayer mm -hmm. in the county, and and we definitely should get what we ask for. We're paying for it, and that kind yes. of sure. comment is coming from public officials down there. Well, you know, it's if our voice if we continue to work together as well, a team, and right. it's the city and its residents, and together, you know, we we've, we've talked about when there are issues and having to go to Annapolis to speak to the lawmakers, right. and we should go in large. Groups and cars and getting and making sure our voices are heard. Yes, absolutely. Yes. Exactly. And together, you're right there. Yes, I believe uh, we're in good shape in that respect. I think our elected officials. The one thing you mentioned during your uh, interview yes. was that you got some strategy plans to communicate more with the community. Absolutely. You're going to implement. Absolutely. Tell us about that. Yeah. Well, um, and I'm working on this one particular, the first now is uh, I'm launching a constituent services website oh, where my, my BlackBerry good that idea. I recently was um, uh, mailed to me, my BlackBerry, my home phone that I have, it's going to be available 24 hours a day for anyone who has any issues. And we're going to work to getting them resolved. Good, I'll call so you at 3 a.m. Give me a call. <laughs> I'm, I'm going to be available, okay? I want people to understand I am available. Yeah. And Communications I'm going to, is important. It is a, important. And then not just hearing you call me, but also following up with you and letting you know the outcome. Right. And then being real to you and telling you, you know, I don't have the answer. I can't do this right now, but we're going to get it fixed. Yeah. We're going to work together. At least illuminate the problem and maybe find the answer. Exactly. Uh, how about this town hall idea you Yes. Presented? Now, my first town hall meeting was to occur last week, but with the snow and um, MLK holiday, mm -hmm. we actually were, were going to push that off just not this Thursday, but the following Thursday. So the first, and the town hall meetings are going to be, the first being just an introduction. I want people to get to know me, sure, right? Right. get to hear me, understand what I'm wanting, my, and not just my vision, but what our vision should be for the city. And, and, and letting voters know that I am a team player, I'm here, I'm going to be here. I'm not going any place. I chose Bowie, and I'm going to remain here. So I just want to, that's going to be the first of the uh, town hall meetings. Mm -hmm. Then we're going to be, we're going to talk on also public safety. I think we're at 15 now um, deaths or homicides mm -hmm. in our county, and we're in January. So we're at up 15. That's, that's really. That's you know, appalling. Yeah, it yeah. is appalling. So I, I want to address public safety. We're going to ask members of our police department, and maybe we'll get the acting police chief out there and have people in our community, the residents, actually get to know and talk to some mm -hmm. of our officers and, and voice their concerns. We're also going to have uh, a town hall meeting to where I've already had discussions with some friends and colleagues of mine that are working in the home modification or the Save the Home Dream project yeah, yeah. Uh, mm -hmm. with NACA and also um, with another agency over, uh, one that's in the district but operates nationwide and they're going to come to our town hall meeting and making information available and talk to individual residents about saving their homes and how you necessarily don't have to move from your home right away. Right. There are other plans and, and modifications and things and other uh, methods of so individuals can keep, can keep their home. Foreclosure is a big problem. Foreclosure is a huge problem. And, and but prior to that town hall meeting, I'm going to have a, I'm working with some of the um, city council members mm -hmm. as well as city um, people here in the city to where we're going to have a job fair. Oh, that's a great idea. Yes. That's an excellent idea. For, for Bowie residents, for Bowie residents, and yeah. I want to stress for Bowie residents. Yes. Yes, Bowie residents will come again to this job fair. and We have um, um, 
employers ranging from Fannie Mae to Comcast. We also have local employers, Walmart, Giant, um, CVS that are all participating. And then, uh, oh, that's great. What's yes, that going to be? We're looking for somewhere towards the end of March, but the first of April okay. um, on a Saturday, so individuals can come out. We're also going to have some people on site to help with resume enhancement. We ask that you have your resume when you right. come, but we're going to have people on site just to enhance it, just to fine tune the resume for them. So yeah, we have a lot of things. So we want to do the job, um, um, actually um, the job fair Perfect. prior to the home modification plan because many of these programs are going to require that you ha are employed mm -hmm. prior to modification of your home. So yeah. and, and many of the employers have agreed to provide on-site hiring. Yes. Mm, that's fantastic. Yes. Well, I never know, heard that before. Well, we're going to bring it here to Bowie. I think it's a great idea. Yes, we have to have our people working. We have to have our people working. Huh. Just to give an idea how I think the results can be real good if it's well done. Yeah. Yes. I started the career Central uh, Maryland Career Fair oh, really? over at the, the stadium. Okay. Detroit stadium. Okay. And we brought economic development in and, of course, the local uh, employment thing. But to make a long story short, uh, they allowed our accommodations there and the oh, employers really? on the and it, it's a little big maybe for what you have in mind but i think the timeliness of the year there versus you may have to go somewhere else but the latest uh the first response we was in there and i had people there to literally take application not total applications when was this? for about the last uh since uh 2002. You do it every year? No, no, I don't do that anymore. Oh, uh, I, I help develop well, then the. So much for that. No, no, but <laughs> no. the whole idea that it's still being done. Yeah, it's still being done every year there. Okay. You'll see the signs, and uh, the base talk's been tremendous about it. Really? But when we had the first. Uh, that would be a good site for the that city. Is, that is a great site, the base. Yeah, the stadium. We, I didn't and even consider that location. Yeah. I think it'd be good. It's great parking. Great and parking, plenty of room. Plenty You're of concentrating room. on Bowie, but yes. um, the Central, it was named that. Um, and, of course, we put out brochures. But, but we had 1,300 applicants the first day. It happened about 10 years ago. 1,300 people come in, and rather than going right to the career fair, we weren't an employer. We just were trying to determine if yeah. this is an I okay. idea to help. Okay. 1,300 applications. Wow. Ten years ago, it was nothing like it is today. Oh, no. Well, no, the most good. recent one that I was involved with just about five years ago, uh, six, says 2,500 people walked in the door. Wow. And I don't know what their figures were this last few years, but I bet it was in the thousands. Oh, it had to be. For the people yeah, in the I'm certain. I'm but certain. the remarkable thing I wanted to mention is I saw people come up there, that my staff was taking their resumes on, and they'd show them to me uh, the first time, a third of them, the city of Bowie. And we expected all of them to be the city of Bowie, but only a third. But others that had been publicized all around the state, and consequently we started getting people from Baltimore, Annapolis, mm -hmm. and so forth. Wow. I think, anyway, if there's any help in there, and there's a lot of people that I could tell you that would join the city and join that your effort in to do it. Well, you know, now know yeah. that I know Bert, that you were, had done this yourself, we're going to also want to tap to you and ask you if you could maybe lend some assistance oh, in yeah. any way. Yes. And some of the people are probably still around. Uh, and we'll hope that the uh, patch that will also put out the message, help get oh, the yeah. word out yeah. about the job fair yeah. for Bowie yeah. residents. Yes. We'd also like <laughs> to uh, get this operation into better shape. Okay. So, it, I mean, it's a potential communications mm -hmm. medium for the entire city of Bowie. Exactly. It's easily available. We just have to get on the draw, get more people in here as yes. producers of shows, yeah. okay. more okay. realistic shows than perhaps we sometimes see, and then use it. I mean, it's got to be used. Yes, it has to be. Yeah, this it's is a, a great resource. It's and an it's excellent a resource. resource. Yeah. Uh, I mean, there's no doubt a lot of people in Bowie that don't even know the studio is available. Absolutely. To them really? to come and learn how to do a camera or uh, It's open to the director. public. Do we have any uh, information out in the schools? I mean, like Bowie High? Over the years. But it's been, t I don't know what it is about Bowie High School. I've tried very, very hardly, very well, very hard, to, and as have others, mm -hmm. to get a, an involvement with the kids in Bowie that are in this sort of program over there. Yeah. Mass communications, here. I assume. It just doesn't seem... Class. To work. Really? Yeah. Wow. 
But we have one. I don't know whether it's territorial or what it is, but my goodness, often, look at this. Often that's <laughs> I mean, the really, case. I agree. Often I that's agree. the case of whether who shares the responsibility yeah. should share mm -hmm. the reward. So many of them want to see what is the reward of me doing that. You don't know until you do it. And believe me, that's often. true. Well, well, let sadly. me tell you, we have a, a person now on board that will help improve a lot of this communication. John okay. will work. Jan Butler. Yes, Jan she was is very the, polite. She phoned me yesterday, and I was saying, what, they want to meet tomorrow? <laughs> so, but I well, made, made it work on my schedule. Sh well, I, I mean, you, you we, call, I come, time, I come. Do it right away, it. you know. Yes. You know, here's the newbie. <laughs> <laughs> Go get him. <laughs> Everyone well, yeah. has been very welcoming and uh, very um, helpful in, in, in giving me an education and wanting to get me up to speed because, as you both mentioned, the budget that's yeah. we're having to look yeah. at very soon. Uh, yes. What your, your outreach is the most impressive thing I've heard today mm -hmm. to Thank the you. community. Thank yeah, you. I'm and in the area I like that. that. I, I wish the heck a lot of other elected officials would understand that. No, I know no we, kidding. We had a congressman who used to have this thing over at the Redskins Stadium, you know, every year. I do. They I bus do. people in and so forth. All of that was to benefit the congressman oh, really? more than the job because the results are so poor. I looked into it. Okay. But... All of a sudden, the last year they did it, that's before he retired. Okay. <laughs> you know, the outcome is unbelievable. But what they had did to fill the crowds, it was really competitive with people who really need jobs. They were pulling kids out of ninth, 10th, 11th grade to come to the career fair, busting them in there. You couldn't get a parking space. And I thought, these are it's a little premature for these why, kids. Why? Yeah, well, I was going to ask, what was the purpose of bringing in ninth and tenth graders? Yeah, they're, yeah. they're parents of voters. <laughs> but I mean, I, they can't be employed. I think it, there's no, a certain there's age you have to are, have even have a work permit, right? We are fortunate locally, for the most part. You know, our mm -hmm. local politicians aren't into self-aggrandizement. Well, I I yeah, don't I see you know they're, they're not. I don't, so no, I we're don't very see very fortunate. I can't say that for the rest of the county. <laughs> <laughs> we have a great team here in Bowie. Oh, I'm so I very proud of them, and most of all, happy to be working with them. Yeah. Yes, being a part of the team. We have a great great staff. Great, a yeah, great staff. You, I mean, you can't you can't have an A A plus city, just an A plus right. city. Yes. Well, what we're going to hope to do this year, if we still continue this effort we make, we've mm -hmm. been doing it 20 years, I'll make a, okay. up in our last few minutes here, we should have the city council people on, on a regular basis like we, I we agree. have had yeah. them all on. I agree. Except one. On a one-to-one -one like this. Just oh, like this. You know. Well, I welcome you guys. Give me a call anytime, and I'll yeah. make it happen. Well, you've made some commitments today now that we'll remind you of. And I know you will. Oh, we will. And, you know, and I, how about we talk each time after we've managed, I've managed to get through one of those. Okay. <laughs> okay. And then you tell me what I haven't done. This because may I, come as a shock to you. Go ahead. And I hope it doesn't hurt you. No, no. But very few people watch the Bowie City Council meetings on television. <laughs> Well, yeah, I, you know, that, that's, I and then, to. but they, it seemed as though 25 of them did, yeah, <laughs> to hear about the opening of Geraldine. So they were there. Oops. Yes. That was well, a good, we have reached good the sound. point of wrap. Mm -hmm. Okay. And it Short was great time. talking to you. It's been a pleasure, guys. Congratulations. Thank you, John. Thank you so much. we look forward to working Thanks, with you. Right. Thank you, Bert. Thank good you. Good to see you. Good to see you both. Good to see you both.